Hi, we're back. Once you get your dough balls made, put them in the bowl and put them back in the refrigerator. This dough gets soft real quickly. So you work with one or two dough balls at a time. Put a little bit of flour. And what we've discovered is my pastry mat has circles on it. You don't want to roll this out bigger than four inches. It, it'll make it too thin and we'll show you why later. We made a boo-boo, that's what we did. So, and it's stiff when it's cold, but you need to work with it quickly. It doesn't need to be a smooth circle, just enough. We are putting strawberry jam in half of them and we're using red bean paste in the other half. This is a sweetened paste, so it makes a tasty cookie, and we've already tried it. It's good. So I squeeze out about a teaspoon in the center of the cookie, and then you fold it up in half, Press together, pull a side up, press, 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 pull it up, press all this together, get it in a circle, then we're going to use the moon cake press. This is the press, and it's a little plunger. And I use a bit of Pam spray. Um, for every two, I spray the mold every two cookies. So, work over a sink, over a trash can, like I did. Then, you take the cookie, put it into the mold, and then you press it in the mold. You don't have to press hard. You're just wanting to press until you've got dough into each of those scallops because the sides are scalloped. Once that's done, you take it over to your cookie sheet. You put it upside down and you press down on the cookie press until you can feel the pan, the dough meet the pan. And then there's two little sides here you can put your fingers on. Hold it, pull it up, and then you tap. Tap, 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 till it drops off. And there's you a pretty little cookie. And we'll do one more. So here we go again. Cold dough, press it a little flat with your hand. Roll it out no bigger than four inches. And about a teaspoon of bean paste or strawberry jam. Pull up the dough. Press together, pull up a side, press, 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 pull it up, and you've got a, like two legs. Press them together and then press them towards the center. Then gently round it up, then put it in your mooncake press. Gently press it down in there. Now, you can go online. There's recipes uh, that are more complicated. You can call the international grocery stores in the Knoxville area, see if they've got any of the ingredients. You can use uh, the lotus seed paste or the red bean paste or like our substitute, the strawberry jam. 
the Mooncake Press. This is a press that came with six different dies, and uh, it's easy to take apart and put together. We ordered it on Amazon. Push, pull it up. There you go. Now, the oven is heated to 375 degrees. These bake for 20 minutes, but set your timer for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, you pull these out and you put an egg yolk wash on them. It's one egg yolk with one teaspoon of water beat together, and we'll show you when we do it. And you brush it over the tops, and then you put it back in to finish cooking for 10 more minutes, which makes a total of 20 minutes. Now, here's the mistake. Here's the boo-boo. I rolled the dough out too thin, and then when I started pulling the cookie together, the dough broke. So we're going to have a busted cookie, and we're more than likely going to have jam on the baking sheet. That's why we use parchment paper anyway, because if you use parchment paper, things don't stick. So we'll see you back in 10 minutes. <laughs> 